14th is coming close. And you know what that means? Smash Wrestling, Havering, Real Wrestle at the Phoenix Theater. And this card is completely mind blowing. You got TDT, Tabernacle Team, taking on the World World Machines. And you know when TDT's in the house, you know it's going to be a heavy hitting match. And if anything happens like it did the last event, the World Machines might not be so well oiled, but maybe they smoothed everything over. Who knows? You'll just have to go see and find out. Then you got a rematch from the Faithful 8 Finals. The Super Smash Brothers taking on the Kevin Bennett experience of Kevin Bennett and Frankie TM. Frankie TM's grounding is finally done, but I'm hoping the Super Smash Brothers get their revenge and kick the shit of that little punk ass weasel Kevin Bennett. And at the end, I'm hoping that um, Frankie's done being your bitch because I want him to make you his bitch. Then we got Vanessa Craven. Craven taking on Casey Two Scoops Spinelli. Oof, you got the monster ma mountain of a woman taking on Casey. Interesting. Very. I don't really have much more to say about that match. <laughs> then you got a six-person match with Tarvik take versus Scotty O'Shea, the hacker, versus Kevin Blackwood, versus the endorsement Sebastian Schwab with Kingdom James, versus Frank Money. Banks versus Belmar. But with all that talent in the ring, you know that's going to be one great match. Then we're getting to the big boys now. You got Zack Saber Jr., the, the Zack Saber Jr., that was a part of WWE's Cruiserweight Classic, taking on. Oshawa's own Mike, the unbreakable Elling. Oh. And, oh, you know, that match, everyone's going to be on pins and needles because it's just going to be an astounding match. I just know it. We also got ROH star Kyle O'Reilly taking on Jeff Cobb. <laughs> Oof. My god, that is going to be outstanding. Another top match brought to you by Smash. And that's not even the main event. The main event is the wrestling machine here, Tyson Dukes, your Smash World Champion, taking on John Greed. And John Greed has something to prove in this match that he is a contender and the hype around him is true but you don't get called the wrestling machine for no reason so you know that is going to be one hell of a match and you get all that entertainment for $25 no brainer there people so if you're in the Toronto area if you can get to Toronto I would highly suggest going to see Smash have Ring Will Wrestle. Because from top to bottom, that card is stacked. And in my opinion, probably one of their better cards I've seen in a while. Well, they always produce high quality cards, but this one just seems to take it up another notch. So, May 14th. Phoenix Theater, $25. Doors open at 3. Bell goes at 4. Go see Smash. You will not regret it. Peace out.